a lot of citizens in Pennsylvania from uh, Pittsburgh to Erie are covered by Highmark. That's where they get their health insurance. And, uh, you know, it's great to have health insurance, but if you can't get to a doctor or a hospital <laughs> because they're not on their uh, coverage list, then you, you got some issues. And there's 2,700 doctors, quite a few medical facilities throughout Western Pennsylvania that uh, are UPMC facilities. And um, if Highmark's uh, insureds, which represents something like 3 million citizens in Western Pennsylvania, can't get to the UPMC facilities because they don't have coverage, it's a problem. What's the bottom line problem? Individuals don't have access to quality health care and they don't have the opportunity to go to the physician of their choice if this disruption between UPMC and Highmark continues. It's important that, that our constituents, the citizens of uh, Western Pennsylvania, have access to these quality health care facilities. And it's also important that people are able to maintain their relationship to their health care provider, um, not only to their doctors, which is a crucial relationship, but also to other health care providers. And what we know is, is that there is an, an argument or a dispute afoot between these two institutions, whereby those who have coverage with Highmark health insurance may not in the very near future be able to get treatment with a UPMC doctor or facility. And um, given the fact that these are community assets, that's, that's really from our perspective not acceptable. And we need to make sure that the parties get together and begin to resolve the issues that are in front of them.